Good morning. We got the, the east out. We got a little South Boulevard Target. Sun's blasting down. But uh, we're getting ready to start a Target run, a little toy hunt video. Can pool collects if you haven't already. Jump in on YouTube and get over to Instagram. Can pool collects. Little Target run, little toy hunt. Hog, Rhino Man, Man Bray, Little E.T., Little Last Ronin, got a couple McFarlane Monsters, so we are making our way back to the collector's area, we got a little bee, look out for the bee, watch out for the bee, all kinds of cards, this uh, Target, they got a pretty good collector's area. It is massive. A little Hocus Pocus. A little Toonie Terrors. A little Wasp. More monsters. Wolfman. Got some predators down there. Uh, what is. Uh, is this like a game? Yeah, I was like, what? <laughs> That's wild. Hudson, Turtle Pack, Little Evil Dead going on, Dracula back there, Goku statue, got some Gundams, Masters of the Universe, Little Anime, Godzilla, More Monsters, look at that big old Goku. Star Wars, got some blind bags, a little gizmo, the Batman, yeah we've been seeing some flash pops, let me know if y'all are excited for the movie, is this a spoiler potential? I guess we'll probably see everybody in the flash movie, right, right, everybody? Got uh, all kinds of plushies, She-Hulk, Wakanda, a red Solo Cup, WWE. Got all kinds of different uh, backgrounds going on. My Hero, Star Wars. Goofy, yeah, new kids on the block. All kinds of just like little things, alien. All right, alien, injustice. Got some Back to the Future. Little Kong. Jones, oh, Friday the 13th, how about Pighead, it's Pighead, all right, let's go check out the main toy aisle and uh, see what else we can find today, all right, still got a big old Mario display, all kinds of Legos going on, there's some of our bigger characters, whoops, Toad down, sorry Toad, Toad. Smaller characters. Luigi. Mario. Yoshi. Are they about to jump on his back? Uh, got some batteries. Batteries are important. Different Legos going on there. Hot Wheels. What we got in the Hot Wheels? Single releases there. I'll check out uh, a Hot Wheels Skate Spider-Man. That's cool. Got five packs there. Rock'em 
Little Sockum, Little Masters of the Universe, Little Wonder Woman. Ultra Hots, Little Mario Karts, got all kinds of tracks this morning. Monster Trucks, Little Yoshi Mobile. Monster truck. That's a matchbox. That's kind of cool. Like utility truck. Nice. Johnny Lightning. Winchester. That's a cool little Tony Hawk. I think that was the funnest thing about the skateboards. Uh, some of the designs that they came out with for uh, the skateboards were very cool. Very cool. Uh, but some mystery stuff. We got a little bit of Pokemon. Luigi getting his flex on, flexing out. Couple video game levels got a good amount of minecraft up there a little bit of halo a little bit of fortnite basic marvel and other stuff transformers not much going on with the transformers is that impulse pretty good look from McFarlane also got our project Superman and our Joker there that's pretty cool flash movie some of our uh, flash page punchers super 7 GI Joe Dungeons and Dragons. Some basic Marvel going on. Little uh, launcher stunt squad. Better not uh, include Gwen Stacy in that pack, right? <laughs> bad, uh, bad timing. I got Drax, got the Baron. That's cool. Scarlet Witch up there. Couple, couple Marvel Legends. Couple of Marvel Legends. What's that? A little mini life right. This uh, overflow. We got some Lokis. We got He Who Remains. A little Star Wars there. So yeah, just a random overflow. Uh, wrestling looking very interesting. We got some prepaid <laughs> Visa cards. The Star Wars Ultimate Warrior, Ultimate Warrior, AJ Styles. Two, not much for AEW. Some different Indiana Jones. Ghost Rider, all kinds of retro Star Wars, little Dark Trooper, more pig head, a few pig heads. Still got uh, the little tank. Surprise, nobody's scooping that up. Indiana Jones. Light year. Beast Man. Stink of War. Got some 93 classics going on there. A few dinos. There's some turtles. Got Donatello, Michelangelo, our Splinter, Leonardo, 
Uh oh. Turtle down. My bad. Somebody is not gonna be happy. Just jacked up that card, right? We got the four turtles there. Bebop, Rocksteady, some of our villains. More 93 classics. Action. All right, I'm gonna look around, but that might do it for this Target. Y'all have been watching, you know why I really came back to this Target store. Oh yeah, got us some pretzel, Chris. Be a nice little uh, snack today. Uh, a lot of the Target stores sold out, so yeah, we're scooping this up. A little Pineville Target, a little South Boulevard Target. Yeah, let's go. Target! Target run! Uh, you know, if you can't find the toys, at least find uh, the snack, right? Uh, we saw Gold Label Impulse. Pretty cool for you, uh, McFarlane. They got quite a bit in the collector's area, whether you're looking at Funko Pop, Super 7, all kinds of different cards and everything going on. So definitely check out those target stores or just uh go get yourself some of these pretzels that's a that's a good hunt in uh in my book good hunt finding uh little pretzels little pretzels little toy hunt but uh we are on our way volleyball going on uh i gotta do a little bit of coaching running a little bit of volleyball today um what are we looking for can't say there's necessarily anything i'm particularly looking for so let me know in the comments are you uh scooping stuff up at target are you getting over to some other stores and uh finding what you want to add to your collection are you doing a uh, little online shopping getting it delivered to the door uh, i might have mentioned it this month mythic legions the deluxe legion builders uh those are on sale so check out your approved four horsemen retailers get yourself uh get yourself a deal the uh, Mythic Legions Deluxe Builders are uh, pretty cool figures and they definitely leave themselves open. So if you ever thought about uh, maybe doing some customizing, some pop and swapping, these are great like base figures where you can kind of build onto the design that they have and uh or they're just great army builders if you want to add to uh to your mythic legions or uh if you're worried about the price point this is an excellent way to uh scoop up a mythic legions figure and uh see what you think but we are headed to uh, a little bit of volleyball and I will catch up with you all after our uh, volleyball day. We finished our tournament day. We got a little Ross for Less. We got a little second in Charles. We're on South Boulevard, Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, let's make a quick trip into Ross and see what we can find today. A little music for you. Music's jamming. We got a few My Hero statues. $12.99. A lot better than, uh, what does that say, 22 so those are kind of cool um yeah just some like random stuff i don't know what that is <laughs> little fortnite down there there's some more fortnite figures had a mario or that's a john cena mario maybe got some of these sonic real metal going on there little sonic vehicles got a little pokemon Basic Marvel. So, got a few of those going on. Little Jurassic World down there. Got the cheap little monster truck. That's kind of cool. 
There we go, look at that. Vision 799. There's that Transformers 1699. It's another Fallen with uh, like the little, yeah. Got the little burger playset, chef set. Jurassic Park going on. Sonic Hulk smashing. Got some Roblox. It's another, they got all kinds of like little Sonic vehicles. A little Halo going on over there. Uh, let's see what's back here. Got like a little Zelda poster. Basic Marvel, Pokemon, whatever these are. And yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this Ross location. Let me know if you're finding anything at your Ross stores. Charles, we got our first glass case. All kinds of Funkos going on in the glass case. Little Jack Skeleton down there. Little uh, lightsaber going on. Comes with sheath, look out. Little Wolverine, little Coulson and Lola. Little Scorpion back there. So yeah, we got a few things. Lots uh, of loose pops. Ooh, is that a Samus blaster? Look out video game people. All kinds of Funkos. Could spend uh, so much time, but they are also rocking the music, so we might have to take a music break here in a minute, just so we don't get uh, the old copyright. But you can see just tons of different Funkos. And let's see what else we can find. From Transformers, Super 7 Thundercats. Predator there, all kinds of different figures going on. Joker, the gold, Terminator, so a lot of different things in the mix. Joker there, plenty of McFarlane. Check this one out. This is uh, what the diamond select. That case is kind of cool with uh, the swords and everything. Uh, what does this guy go for? 24 bucks. Gotham series. Uh, I got an AJ Styles there. Just hanging out. Uh, Rampage. I think you've seen that. With, uh, the Pride. Get all the McFarlane. Tons of McFarlane figures. Bit of League of Legends there, like a big old box. Got on this side, Vemos, all kinds of loose figures, little Batman going on. I don't know what's going on here. Skelly God, all kinds of loose figures. Funkos, wrestlers. Uh oh, what was that? This one's got bubble wrap. It must have uh, fell before. Transformers in there. More Funkos, a loose. Oh, uh, let's see what we got in this glass case. Those some swords. That's pretty cool. Transformers. Got some Gundam models going on. Uh, look at uh, the One Piece there. That's kind of cool. Demon Slayer. Got some Play Arts Full Metal. I don't think they're $19.99. I could be wrong. Gun or Dragon Ball GT. Little plushies there. That's a little Hogwarts. Statue, Korak, and Merman going on. All kinds of different stuff today, huh? Game of Thrones back there. Ooh, there's uh, the little select 
of uh, the little X-Men gate. Uh, I always wanted to scoop those up. That's a cool diorama piece. I would be a lot more tempted if they had both gates. <laughs> Joker there, alien. There's a big old dragon, Logan. So yeah, definitely some different stuff today. Uh, let's look on this side. Deadpool, Batman, ooh, look at the Goku, Thanos, ooh, there's a big old Gandalf there, what's Gandalf, uh, the staff would be pretty cool, I don't know if it's $30 cool though, sword doesn't look bad either, definitely some soft goods, yeah, I don't know for 30 bucks. Maybe if he was like 10 or 20, that'd be some interesting pieces to maybe work with there. Ooh, look at this. Little uh, Ecto Squad. Missing the figure and like the missiles and stuff, but that's a pretty cool little Echo suit. Those used to be fun. Got Apocalypse there. Some more DC, a foot soldier. I just got a lot of stuff mixed in. Combat. Ooh, these are kind of cool. Army of Darkness, Ash. Got the KB toys there. Yeah, these are pretty cool. And that background piece would be a lot of fun to. Uh, Maybe play around with, maybe get that movie Maniacs and do something in the center there. Uh, again, 30 bucks. Ooh, there's the uh, Army of Darkness. That's Evil Ash. That's a pretty cool head sculpt. Swords look real good. Yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. I'm guessing probably, yeah, about 30 bucks for both. 30 bucks each. Definitely some fun ideas there. A <laughs> little Ted Lasso. Is that, uh, I have no idea what that is. Huh, interesting. Got some Funko Colas. Got Drax. Robotech, Hobbit. A Walking Dead going on, Star Wars, got Ahsoka and uh, Grogu there, more Transformers, My Hero, we might have saw that last time we were here, it's a bag of DC, Vegito, Harley's, All kinds of uh, out of package Funkos. Look at this, this is almost like a Harley Award <laughs> trophy. Skeletor, got Battle Cat going on. Yeah, I think I looked at this Slade last time I was here. A Sonic, Star Wars. That actually might be the Star Wars uh, Transformer. Power Rangers. Oh, that trunks doesn't look bad. Ooh, what do we got here? 17. For a little Gimli. Hmm. That's some cool uh, look there. I don't know. Is this uh, Diamond Select? Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, the axes look great. We got like the little pack and stuff. Yeah, that could make for some good bonder. Might have to keep an eye on that one, see if they do like, sometimes they do little sales. Oh yeah, check this out. We got, these things are just breaking on me. There's a goblin, and a 
asking uh, 24 he's got a couple head sculpts he got some different pieces there 24 so that's almost like new they're gone uh, what are they doing on this guy this might be is this like the old toy biz one so this one's 10 bucks but I don't see a ton, like maybe that whip, but there's not a ton that you can get off of him. Uh, ACDC, a Marvel, Hit Girl. Look at all the like little daggers and stuff, that's wild. Swords. Uh, we'll get on this side. Batman, little gaming, Dino there, Game of Thrones, there's some more Diamond Select, Assassin's Creed, that's pretty cool, all the little gear and stuff, Witcher, little John Cena, alright, I'm gonna look around but we'll see what else we can find. Got some comic books laid out, but a few more pieces. So we got a Leonardo statue of Michelangelo. Check out uh, that like Doctor Who, that Leonardo. That's pretty wild, 114 bucks for that guy. Uh, got some Warhammer going on. Some different Warhammer stuff. Little uh, cars down there. But uh, check this out, a couple statues, that girl. Invisible Woman, got a Scarlet Witch and a Wonder Girl, a little Dragon Ball, Jubilee there. So those are some pretty cool little statues going on. And then, uh, yeah, not too much more. Spider-Man 2099 and uh, the Mandroid. All right, I think that's gonna do it for Second and Charles. All finished up. Little second in Charles, a uh, little speed bump, little speed bump. But yeah, not bad. Uh, definitely some cool things at second in Charles. That X Men gate, definitely something uh, I've looked at here and there in uh, the past. Fun little diorama piece, uh, getting both pieces together. Not, uh, not an easy task, at least the last time I tried. Uh, I think some people were like 3D printing it, so that might be an option for uh, kind of getting that and painting it and putting it together. But yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. If they had both gates, I'd be a little more interested, but <laughs> I don't know how difficult it would be to get the second piece, if that piece was even a decent price it was probably probably a little expensive because it was in the case but let me know in the comments uh are y'all finding anything at ross do you have a store like second and charles where uh, you know you find different things traded in and whatnot definitely uh let me know what store that is in the comments and uh, let me know where it's located. Uh, it's always fun to hear about what uh, you all have in your area, what you find, but usually some interesting things at uh, Second and Charles. Worst case scenario, you're gonna see uh, all the books a million stuff. So typically a good amount of the McFarlane DC figures, uh, Marvel Legends here and there, depending on, you know, what uh what they're ordering sometimes more sometimes less but uh every once in a while you find that cool piece that uh somebody brought in out of nowhere we found uh like build a figure pieces and stuff in the past actual build of figures you know like you saw the mandroid and whatnot so you never know what you might walk into uh lord of the rings pieces those were cool uh, again, with the fonder and stuff, the the one p piece was uh, probably an older toy biz that work for ten bucks. If everything was uh, probably around that cheap, I would have considered it. 
but uh, we'll see if it hangs there for a while and every once in a while they run some like discounts and sales so maybe uh, maybe eventually we'll pick some of that up for some fonder uh, like right now I'm not huge on uh, the dwarfs so no rush there uh, with our goblins we got quite a bit <laughs> but you know the goblins would definitely be fun uh, that head sculpt and maybe that helmeted head sculpt and uh, just playing around seeing where those armor maybe even arms could uh, potentially work on a custom but hopefully you enjoyed the video. Smash that like button, comment, and share. If you haven't already, jump into Kent Pool Collects. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube over on Instagram, Kent Pool Collects. Go check out uh, Kent Pool Collects on Instagram. Give me a follow. Uh, every once in a while, I will put videos and pictures up there before the YouTube videos. So definitely a great way to see what's uh, in the Carolinas. And if you're around the Carolinas, hopefully it help you find what you're looking for. If uh, you're not in the Carolinas, uh, maybe you'll see we got it here and go check out your stores and that toy time and find those, uh, find those figures, right? But uh, thank you to everybody supporting the channel. Thank you to our channel members. Y'all are too kind. It is uh, just too sweet seeing channel members. So thank you for supporting the channel in that fashion. Until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting.